Look at him, Blaze. I'm sleeping. Ah, he's so cute when he sleeps. So, do you want to wake him up? Yeah, I'll get him up and I'll meet you in the living room. Okay. Charmy. Charmy. Oh. 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 Hey, Dad. Hey, Charmy. Sorry to wake you up, but me and your mother have something to tell you. Really? What is it? You gotta come to the living room to find out. So, um, just um, get yourself out of bed, get ready, and come to the living room when you're ready, and we'll tell you. All right. <clears throat> hey, guys. Good morning, Charlie. So, what's this thing you wanted to tell me about? Oh, yeah, right. Oh, uh, go ahead, please. All right, okay. Well, see... I have this friend, um, from my dimension, that I'm from, and, well, recently, a hurricane came by, and it destroyed her home. Oh, that's horrible. I know, and we offered her to come stay with us until her home was fixed. Well, that was nice of you. Yes, and... Wondering if it was okay with you. Maybe she could stay in your bed for a little bit. Oh. Oh. Well, um. Sure, that's, that's fine, I guess. I don't mind. Oh, thanks, Jeremy. So, when is this mysterious girl gonna come? Mm, right about now, because we're gonna go get her. Yep. Later, Charmy. Well, well, guess they're gone. <sighs> well, I guess I might as well just wait here until they get back then. Ugh. 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 Come on, pull harder. What do you think I'm doing? You're too heavy. What the? <sighs> That's the last time I carry you. What the vector? Espio, what are you guys doing? Were you listening to our entire conversation? Apologies, Charmy. It wasn't my idea. Oh, get off my back! So what if I'm a little curious? But yeah, we heard everything. Yeah, so I heard you- I assume that you heard about the part where I had to share my bed? Yup. That sucks. I remember when I had to share a bed with Espio. Ugh, it was torture. <laughs> it was more torture for me than it was for you. No way! Your stupid horn nose thing kept poking me the entire time! And your whole body kept crushing me the entire time. What are you trying to say? I'm fat? No, you're big and tall. Guys, can you not argue right now? I have a lot on my mind. Like what? The fact that I have to share a bed with someone. A girl? Like, that's a little odd, isn't it? Oh, I wouldn't say so. I mean, brothers and sisters share beds sometimes. Yeah, but that's the problem. This mysterious girl isn't my sister, and she's some random stranger that I'm about to be sharing a bed with. Well, I won't deny that is a little odd. But try not to think about it too much, Charlie. Sooner or later, you'll get your bed back to yourself. Yeah, probably. What if he doesn't? What if this... House never gets rebuilt, and then Charmy will have to pretty much just put up with her in her in your your bed forever, and then she'll never leave. She'll pretty much just you know eat everything, all of your food, all of your everything, and then pretty much she'll eat your house. Stop talking. Now you're just spewing nonsense. But it could be true. It happened to a buddy in college one time. Sure. Don't listen to him, Charmy. Sooner or later, this mysterious girl will eventually go back to her own nice home, and eventually you'll have your nice bed all to yourself again. <sighs> I hope so. Yeah, cheer up, kid. It'll be all right. So, when did your parents go to leave and get this mysterious girl? Like, right before you guys popped up. And when would they be back? 
We're back. We see. So, uh, where is this mysterious girl, huh? Oh, she's just outside. She's just a little shy, that's all. Oh, here she comes right now. Hello, my name's Marine. Nice to meet you. Pleasure to meet your acquaintance. Uh, Charmy? You gonna say hi? Charmy? Hi. Nice to meet all of you. So you're Blaze's son, right? Uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, adopted. Oh, I see. <laughs> I see you finally decide to have a kid. <laughs> yep. Even if it is adoption, we still love him like our own. Cute. So, uh, when are you gonna have uh, another one, hmm? <laughs> Marine? What? I'm just messing around. I can say what you mean when you say she teases you a lot about us. <laughs> yep, she loves to do that. <sighs> well, this is a really nice place, Blaze. Um, where am I going to be staying? Oh, you're going to be staying in Charmy's room. Ooh, yay! It'll be like we're roommates. Uh, yeah, roommates. Right. <laughs> uh, um, can I be excused? I'm kind of having a stomachache. Oh, yeah, sure. Go ahead, Charmy. Thanks. <laughs> hmm. What's that all about? So, Marine, since you're gonna be staying here for a little bit, can I offer you something? Like some water or some food? Oh, well, I haven't had breakfast yet. Oh, well, then come with me. I'll make you some breakfast. But why can't I make breakfast? Because you'll burn it. But, hey! I'm just kidding. Oh. <laughs> well, she seems nice. Yeah, but... What was up with Charmy earlier? Why did he act all weird like that? Hmm. Well, I'm not sure, Espio. But if the hunch is right, I think our B-boy might be in love. <laughs> what happened out there? Why did I get so nervous around that girl? What's going on with me? Am I sick? I don't feel sick. Oh, what is this weird feeling? Ah, oh, oh. Are you alright, Charmy? Uh, not really. What happened up there, bud? I've never seen you that weirded out before or something. You just acted way different than usual. I don't know what it was, guys. It's just that when I saw that girl out there something inside of me just like something snapped or something like i just felt this weird feeling in the, in here and i don't know what it is i'm just i don't know oh, i can't breathe oh. easy there charmy easy we're here for you yeah bro so i know this might be hard to believe, but I have a ginormous feeling that this feeling you're having is, well, the feeling of you being in L-O-V-E. What's L-O-V-E? You're in love. What? No, 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 no. I, I can't be in love. There's no way. I mean, uh, I mean... I, right? I, I'm just six. I can't be in love. So what? You know, Cream is six years old, and she's with Tails. And their relationship's perfectly fine. Yeah, but that's different. I mean, I never had a real crush before. The only kind of girlfriend I had at one point was Cream, but that only lasted a week, and I don't even think we were really in love. It was just more of us just liking to spend time together, that's all. But this is different. I actually feel something for this girl. Well, why don't you try to tell her how you feel? What? No way. I, I just met her. There's no way. I can't do that. Mm, fair point. Well, maybe try to hang out with her. Yeah, show her your video games and stuff, and your gamer stats. Ladies love a good gamer stat. 
de do. Oh yeah, you show a girl all of the great achievements you've achieved in a video game, they'll be all over you. That's not exactly really good advice. Oh, whatever, what do you know? Trust me, Charmy, this is gonna work. You show her your gamer stats, she's gonna be all over you. She's gonna love you until the day you die, and she's gonna love you in the afterlife. You really think so? I know so. Ugh, this is not gonna end well. I guess I could do that. Yeah, I'm gonna do that! Yeah, that's my boy! You are giving him horrible advice. He doesn't need to show a girl her game or his gamer stats just to make her like him. All he needs to do is just be himself. Well, yeah, he could do that too. After the gamer stats. Why do I even try? Oh, someone's coming. Come on, SBO. Time to bounce. Ugh. Hi, so this is the room I'm gonna be staying in. Hi, hello again. <laughs> uh, hi. Uh, I mean, uh, uh. sup. Uh, Rose wasn't kidding when she said this bed was big and bouncy. Yep, very big and uh, bouncy, comfy bed. Yep. Oh, my name? <laughs> uh, Charmy V. Maybe no, I can, but I assumed you already knew that. <laughs> yep. Maybe if I ask her something. Yeah, I'll ask her something. So, um, what's it like back in the dimension mom's from? Oh, uh, nothing much. Mainly she just comes by every now and then to check on her little soul and milk thingies. Other than that, I'm very eventful. Though I do like to ride around in my ship every now and then. You have a ship? Yep, pretty cool, right? Very much cool. So, what do you like to do for fun? Well, um, I, well, um... Would you get over here? Oh, well, um, I like to play video games. What's a video game? What? You don't know what a video game is? No. Wow. This is a first. Hmm. Well, I think it's about time you know. Here, follow me. Uh, okay. So you see, Marie, a video game is kind of like, well, a physical game, except, well, instead it's on, like, this giant TV screen. And they come on this thing called a video game console, and, well, let me just show you. See, this is a controller, and with it, I can control the TV. Kinda. Well, I can control the game on the TV. So, see, look. Wow, that's cool. Yeah, and you see all those little things on the screen? Those are the games we play. Like this one. Oh, wow, this looks cool. Yeah, and, uh, let me show you my, um, stats on the game. See, I'm in Platinum. That's one of the highest ranks in the game. Wow, that's really good. I think, right? Yep, that's great. So, um, maybe you want to play with me? I uh, sure. I'd love to play. Well, here, give me a second. Uh, got another controller for you. Hi, oh, boy, I'm excited. I've never played a video game before. Get ready. This is going to be one of the coolest things you've ever done in your life. Let's go! Oh, I won again! Wow, you're good for a beginner. Oh, thanks. And thank you so much for teaching me about video games. No, oh, gosh, it was nothing really. So, do you want to do anything else now? Um, yeah, sure. Maybe we could. Oh, <laughs> you hear that? That's my stomach. I guess I'm getting a little hungry, so. I'll go get a meal, and then I'll come back, okay? Uh, sounds good. Uh, see you later, you know. <laughs> Person's gotta eat when they gotta eat, you know. <laughs> Hi. See you in a little bit. <sighs> For real, this is the last time I'm carrying you. I'm sure that's what you say every week. Were you listening to our entire conversation again? Sorry, but I saw how it went. Seems like it's going pretty well so far. You even showed her your stats. How did she like them? Well, she seemed pretty impressed. That's good, that's good, that's good. But she even had more fun and was more impressed with, you know, the game itself and having fun with me. 
Yeah, because he was being himself. Oh, poppycock, who cares? Listen, Charmy, here's the next step in order to getting a girl to like you. You see, her house could be rebuilt any day now. So, pretty much, you gotta spend as much time with her as possible. So I say, go out for a jog, maybe buy her something nice, and, um, be yourself. Mm, yeah, 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 sure, sure. Mm, I don't know. All this sounds really complicated. Trust me, kid. It'll be good. Well, gotta go. Don't listen to him, Charmy. Trust me. All you have to do is just be yourself, okay? I gotta go. Bye. Alright. I'm back. So, now that my belly's full, what do you want to do? Well, um, why not go out and have some fun outside? Oh, sounds like so much fun. Okay, come on, let's go. Whoa. actually really really fun oh it's the most fun i've had in a long time thanks for having fun with me i was a little worried at first that we wouldn't really get along after all it is my first time being in this house and um i don't really know that many people here aside from blaze and silver i didn't really know that many people oh well you got me right and you don't have to be nervous about anything, you know. If you have any problems, you can always come here and talk to me, and, you know. I'll make you feel better. Oh, that's so sweet. Thanks. <laughs> well, I think I probably should go to bed. After a long day I just had, I am getting kind of tired. Yeah, that's fair enough. Well... Um, I guess I'll meet you in the bed a little bit later. Also, can I maybe ask you something? Yeah, sure. Anything. Well, earlier, why did you get all nervous about me? Oh, that? Well, I, um, well, um, stomach ache. That's all. That's, that's all what is, really. Are you sure? Are you sure it had nothing to do with me? No, not at all. Oh, well, that's good. I was beginning to think you just didn't like me. What? No, I'm not really the judgy type person. Oh, right, well, that's good. But if I am going to be brutally honest, actually, the reason was just because I kind of just got nervous, because, well, um... Yeah? Um... It's nothing. Are you sure? Yeah, positive. Okay. Well, good night then, new friend. <clears throat> oh, she hugged me. Oh, I got hugged! My boy got hugged! Let's go! Are you serious? I tried to stop him. <laughs> So, how'd it go? Well, I think it went pretty well. After all, we hung out. I taught her about video games. We went outside for a little bit. And we looked at some cute flowers. I beat up a snake. Casual stuff. Oh, I see. Wait, did you say beat up a snake? Oh, 
we're happy for you, Charmy, that it's going well. Yeah, and before she went to bed, she hugged me. It was one of the greatest feelings in the world. Oh, ho, ho. this is one of the three steps of getting a girl. Step one is, well, hang out with the girl. Step two, hang out with the girl more to the point where you get a hug. And step three is the kiss. You've already beaten all two steps. There's only the kiss one left. Well, I don't know about that, Vector. I've never had a kiss before. Yeah, don't you think that's a little too fast? Maybe, but I don't make the rules. So you think that, um, you think she might like me? Well, mm, I'm not exactly sure, Charmy. I think she does. Well, she hasn't really made any real signs that she does. What if she doesn't? Oh, that's just ridiculous. She might be just shy about it. Who knows, really? Try not to think about it too much, Charmy. Anyway, it's getting away. It's time to go to bed. Uh, and it's t I think it's time for you to go to bed too, mister. Oh, uh, you're not my dad! <sighs> See you in the morning, Charmy. Good night, guys. Hmm. <sighs> Maybe we're just not meant for each other. I don't know. She's really cute and nice and really fun to hang out with. But uh, I just don't know. Hmm. <laughs> Well, I guess I better just go ahead and go to bed. Mm. Well, I guess I'll go ahead and just go to bed then. <sighs> mm. Mm. Still really cold though. Trying to wake him up. Mm, all right. Charmy. Uh, 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 oh, hey, Mom. Hey. <clears throat> Morning. Sorry to wake you up, but we've got some really exciting news. Hey, what is it? Come to the living room when you're ready, and then we'll tell you. All right. Come on, Marie. All right. <clears throat> We're here. Where are you two? Have a seat. Alrighty then. Well, we have some exciting news. Well, what is it? Well, guess what, Marine? They finished your house. What? Really? Already? Yeah, it turns out they finished it a lot sooner than th they thought it would take, so... You can go home now. Oh. Uh, uh, that's exciting. Oh, yeah, that's, that's, that's good for you, Marine. that's nice. Man, also, that means for you, Charmy, that you get your bed all to yourself again. Isn't that great? Yeah, really, that's really nice. Really nice. Something wrong? No, uh, nothing is wrong. What about you, Marine? No, everything's fine. It's fine. All right, then, well... I guess we'll, um, go ahead and take you home later, Marine, alright? I, I can't. Alright, come on, please. Alright, well, I guess my home is fixed. So, so I guess I can go home now. Mm, yeah. Well, well, I'm happy for you, Marine. You know, your home is back, so now you can go back and live there and, you know, for another while. Hmm, I know it's sad, but maybe I can come and visit every now and then. I guess, but it just wouldn't be the same. I guess not. Hmm. Well, I guess before I leave, I better go maybe create something. Wait, Marine. Yeah? 
Listen, I didn't know that you were gonna leave this early, but now I know you do. I have to tell you something. What is it, Chami? Listen, that whole feeling I had earlier, last night or yesterday, I don't really know. Listen, that whole feeling I had is because, well, oh, yeah? I kind of like you. Huh? Listen, at first, I thought you were going to be like some kind of stranger living in my bed and messing things up, you know. But now that I know you more, I know you're not like that at all. You're, you're nice, you're sweet, you're, you're cute, and, well, I, I genuinely think that you're a really nice person to hang around with. So there, I said it. That's the reason I acted so weird around you yesterday, okay? I admit it. There, I said it. Gosh, Chami, I, I don't know what to say. It's fine if you don't feel the same at all, but I just wanted to let you know that I really care about you. That's all, okay? So, um, I'm gonna go in my room. Wait, Chami, come back. I'm not feeling great. Wait, Chami, I didn't know you felt that way. Hmm. <sighs> Why did I do that? You did it because you cared. Huh? Hey, Charmy. Hey, SBO. Where's Vector at? Still sleeping. Figures. Listen, I saw what you did out there. And that... was really brave of you to tell her. I'm proud of you. Because... You were yourself the entire time and told her completely how you felt about her. Despite the fact that she might not even like you like that back, you still told her. And that took guts. You have my respect. Cool. Thanks. But she's still leaving. I know. And I'm sorry for that. But hey, maybe every now and then maybe Blaze can bring her over for... Maybe a play date between you two. Yeah, maybe. But until that happens, there's not really much you can do now. She still has to leave, and... Well... I know, I know. It's okay. I'm happy for her home getting rebuilt. So I should just be happy for her instead of being sad that she's leaving. Exactly. Uh, thanks, SBO. No problem. Charmy, Espio, Vector, can you come in the living room, please? We're saying goodbye to Maureen. Well, there it is. She's about to leave. Well, let's go say goodbye. Right, let's go say goodbye. Ugh, why did you make me get up so early? Sorry, Vector, but we wanted you to be here because we're saying goodbye to Maureen now. Oh, she's leaving already? Yep, her house is rebuilt a lot more faster than we thought. Probably because it's made out of wood. Like, just plain wood. I'm here. I'm here. Hey, Tommy. Hi. So, all of you, say good You say your goodbyes, because as soon as you're done, I'm going to go ahead and teleport her back to her own dimension. Well, even though I didn't know you that much, you seem like a good kid, so I'll miss you. It was a pleasure to have you stay here with us. Even if it wasn't for that long, it was still a pleasure. Thanks. What about you, Charmy? What do you got to say? Well, I already really said my real goodbye to earlier. Kinda. But, well, it was nice knowing you and seeing you. And it was a pleasure to have you stay in my room. So, yeah, I'll miss you. I'll miss you, too. Well, guess we're done, then. All right, everyone, stand back. It's time to go back to your dimension, Marine. All right. Goodbye. See you later. Bye, Marine. It was nice seeing you. Bye. All right, here we go. Oh. <laughs> oh. Marine, what's wrong? Yeah, what's going on? I don't want to leave. What? Why? Your home's rebuilt. You can go home now. I, I just... It's, it's hard to 
to explain. Marie, you can tell me anything. It, it's Charmy. Huh? Me? What did I do? You stole my heart. That's what you did. No, oh, gosh. <laughs> do you have any idea what's going on? Not a clue. I like Charmy, that's why. What? Huh? I knew it! See, Charmy, it's... When I walked in the door, you were just so cute looking. And then all the time we spent together, it was really nice. No one's ever done anything for me like that. And haven't had that much fun in years. Oh, well, I, I was happy to help. And then when you told me that you liked me, I just... Something inside of me, you know, just weird feeling, you know? In here? Yeah, in there. I think I'm in love with you, Charlie. Oh, well, you already know I am too. Oh, Marine, I don't want you to go. I don't want to go either. <laughs> oh, this is sad to see. I certainly didn't expect this place. Me either. I didn't know Charmy had a crush on her. Me either. Charmy, why didn't you tell us? I was so nervous. I had never had a real crush before. And it's just... It was just hard to explain. Same reason why I didn't tell any of you either. Oh gosh. What do we do, Blaze? I don't know. I don't want to separate them. I don't want them to be sad. What do we do? Hmm. Oh. <laughs> Charmy, Marine, can I talk for a minute, please? Yeah, sure. Okay. Listen, I really wish you two would have told me sooner. Otherwise, I wouldn't have, you know, made, almost made Marine leave. But now I know about all this. Well... Maybe it would be best if Marine should stay. Wait, really, Blaze? Do you mean it? Well, what about her other home in the other dimension? Well, she could, of course, go back to there any time she would want to go. After all, her ship is there, after all. That is true. Do you really mean it, Mom? Marine can stay? Yep, she can stay in your room and sleep in your bed. Yay! Yay! Oh, it's so emotional. Oh, I'm crying. <laughs> so now, Marine, now that you stay here, well, what do you want to go do? Let's go have a fun. Yay! That's my boy. I raised him well. You raised him, don't you mean we? We're not a gay couple, Espio. That's not what I meant! Why, we found him on our doorstep. Yeah, so technically, we raised him. Yeah, but it was, you know, technically my house. Yeah, that I lived in and we shared together. Oh, you're making this way more complicated than it needs to be. All right, I've had enough of your excuses. Ow, my schnoz! Come here! Yeah, come on. You like that? Yeah. Should we stop this? Nah, I just want to see how this plays out. Uh, yeah, choke, die, even die. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> well, for a minute there, I thought you were actually going to kill me. Oh, I could if I wanted to. I could easily just snap your neck. But I'm not going to. Because I love you, bud. Thanks. Oh, I'm so happy you get to live here, Marine. We're going to have so much fun together. I know. So wait. Does this mean you're my girlfriend now? Well... Do you want me to be? Well... <laughs> um... Kinda. <laughs> well, do you want to? Does this answer your question? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Look at that blaze. Our son had his first kiss! Step number three, completed.